y'all, it's Anne. Welcome. We're, today we're going to be talking about the hip lift from belly dancing. So here I'm showing it in slow motion. You can see you step to the front and the other leg shifts to the back. And then you lift your hip up. Now this is belly dance abs and this comes from your abdominals. So here I'm demonstrating where this comes from in your abdominals. It's right in there and it's, it's, it's a deep muscle. It's not one of the surface muscles. Now this is me showing you what it looks like when you push it through your butt. You don't want to push it through your butt. You really want to pull it in through your abs. Yeah, not the butt. Unattractive with the butt. There we go. Abs. And this is me demonstrating the hip lifts from the routine. And you can see, you can take it out to the side, same basic motion, all coming from the abs, not the booty. Excited to bring you a series on belly dance moves. So first of all, whenever you do belly dance, it's a good idea to have a scarf. This helps you pay attention to your hips, and belly dance is all about the hips. So we're going to start out with a shimmy. Shimmies tend to work our thighs a lot. We start by pulling our pelvis in, our abs up, and tucking our buttocks. We raise our chest and open our arms. You want your shoulders to be down. And then you push your knee back, but don't lock out your knee. You push your knee back, creating a bounce in your booty, which we call a shimmy. Here I raise it up, I go a little faster. The knees just are smaller, and remember not to lock out those knees. You take a slight bend, this will create the burn in your thighs. Now we get a rear view, and I want to point out here that there's a lot of shaking going on, and that's okay. It is a great thing to make that booty shake like that because we must remember the more we shake it the more calories that are going to just fly off so watch out 